play matters still further. Well, those inside saw Devon White with his strength and Paul Smith's lovely little centre make a chance, but Phil Pennell miscued it completely. When Sheffield United began to threaten, a chance for Nigel Martin's goalkeeping to shine after his earlier shakiness. So to the half-time interval and uh, afterwards Rovers to take the game to Sheffield and Rovers ought to have clinched an important win. Pennell's run beats Ryan, but his cross finds Gary Penrice, Devon White and Young Smith all unable to catch in. Sheffield United's leading scorer Tony Agana dangerous, but watch Vaughan Jones for super defending. Pennell, though, was really warming to his work down that left wing. And after he makes a nice little run, exchanges passes with Reese. Pennell makes the breakthrough because that tackle is a judged unfair, illegal, a penalty, and Ian Holloway obliges. So Rovers ahead now, and Paul Smith beginning to show that he could penetrate down his right wing. A nice run by the youngster, and a chance for Penrice to demonstrate his shooting, but Graham Benstead is goalkeeping too. Next, immaculate defender Jeff Twentyman's pass frees Penrice. And a chance now for Smith to put Sheffield two down, but Smith can't make it. So when uh, Sheffield's substitute Francis Joseph set up a chance for Tony Agana, he took it most adroitly, his 19th goal of the season. Good job Sheffield's 17 goal Brian Dean was missing injured. So a 1-1 draw, meaning Sheffield stay in fourth place and Rovers just one behind.